Hey YouTubers, um, YouTubians, YouTubits. I wanted to show you my version of a uh, highly modified five gallon bucket water filtration system. There are several videos on YouTube that show you how to use the candlestick filters and a couple of five gallon buckets to make a very effective water filter. Uh, and there are different types of candle filters. I'm actually using some uh, leftover big Berkey filters that I've got, the uh, black Berkey water filters. A company that does make some outstanding filters is called ProPure. Uh, www.propureusa.com Them filters remove about everything. They're awesome. They're $100 for a pair. And back to this, I've made a few modifications on, on the other ones that you've seen. Uh, as you can see here, I put in an actual spigot uh, so I can just stick my glass under it and get me a drink. Over here, I put in a hose where I can see my water level. As you can see right there, I've got a little less than half of a bucket in there. I also use the uh, I use the three gallon buckets rather than the five because it's a little less top heavy, a little, e little easier to move. And I just think it's a little better setup. As you can see here, I've got some coffee filters. This is something else I've added in the top. This is a uh, sorry for the shaky camera. This is my iPhone. This is a strainer I bought at Walmart. Uh, had a handle on it. I cut it off. Put the strainer there. Put in a coffee filter, boom. That's going to remove all your big sediment uh, if you're using pond water, lake water, or whatever. Should help your filters last a little longer, less times you have to clean your buckets out. Uh, you take this off, you can see in here I've got my two black Berkies. Uh, pretty simple setup, you just drill a hole in the bottom of one, run it through here, you can see when they come through the bucket, holes down there where the lineup can go through. Pretty simple setup. You can also take your dirty water, run it through something like an old t-shirt or something to get the big stuff out. And then use the coffee filter to remove any, you know, super small sediment. Uh, should protect your filter and get you a little more life out of everything. Uh, filters are dirt cheap. You can get a packet like that for like 99 cents for 200. Uh, I've actually got thousands of those. Handy for all kinds of things. Uh, that's it. If you got any suggestions or comments or how I can improve this, uh, post it, let me know. Thanks.